Rich at the police. Hey, Chicho, what's your take on the Olympic gender boxing? Uh, crazy. One of the things I'll mention is my partner told me this. One of the boxers that people on social media were saying that uh, she, I'm going to say she, she was a transgender. She told me that she wasn't transgender. This boxer is at, was actually born female. She just has a higher testosterone than your average Olympic boxer or average athletes. And the World Championship Boxing Association banned her from boxing in the World Championship Boxing, right? Because her testosterone levels were too high. But the Olympic Games didn't ban her from boxing because her testosterone levels were high, right? Now, I didn't go past that my partner told me this because for me the the agenda is to cancel women in the western world right but the olympic boxing one look into yeah i, I changed my yeah elder god I, I agree i changed my mind for me f the world championship boxing if someone was born female and if they have a higher testosterone level so what right and the World Boxing uh, Organization said, no, her testosterone is too high. They were telling her she had to take pills to suppress her testosterone, take pharmaceuticals to suppress her testosterone level, to level, level her out with the rest of the boxers. Well, excuse me, you're trying to do biologically change someone who was born that way because you're too stupid to realize that that's nature doing this thing? So after World Boxing Championship, if they actually did this, and kudos to the Olympic organization that said, no, we're not going to suppress someone's testosterone level because they're born that way. But F them for allowing people, people, men who have transitioned to women to beat the crap out of women that were biological females, right? I disagree with that, okay? I don't think I disagree with pharmaceuticals. Like, for example, most world championships, most, most athletic organizations in the world ban, uh, uh, what do you call it? The, the, the steroids, right? Ban steroids or anything like that, pharmaceutical, that makes you go poof, right? Makes you go poof, destroys your internal organs. It's pharmaceutical, not nasty, nasty right they ban it but they're okay with taking other types of pharmaceuticals to do other things no totally disagree right so it's it's a rabbit hole you should go down uh, and each situation is different right for me as far as i see it any attempt to cancel women f them right you have no right centralized power has no right to cancel women they're canceling women to a level of this, okay? In Canada, in Canada, teachers are no longer allowed to say mother. I know this because I know someone that's teaching in a nursing school and they were teaching the class and they said the mother, they were talking about giving birth and stuff. They said mother and some one of someone in class said, uh, I'm sorry, you can't say mother you have to say birthing person right birthing person and the teacher was like what what are you talking about no mother right and they complained to the school board the company that's doing the teaching and they suspended the teacher because the teacher was using the word mother so in canada and most of the western world i think in minnesota it's just remove the word mother or something like that's crazy they're trying to cancel women i i don't agree with canceling women right i'm a feminist <laughs> f the woke feminist they're not feminists they're trying to cancel women right 